The Diary of Samuel Pepys, 7th of May, 1660. This morning, Captain Cutton sent me 12 bottles of Margate Ale. Three of them I drank presently with some friends in the coach. My lord went this morning about the flagships in a boat to see what alterations there must be as to the arms and flags. He did give me order to also to write for silk flags and scarlet waist clothes, for a rich barge, for a noise of trumpets and a set of fiddlers. Very great deal of company come today, among others Mr. Bellassus, Sir Thomas Lethrop, Sir Henry Chichley, Colonel Philip Honeywood and Captain Titus, the last of whom my lord showed all our cabins, and I suppose he is to take notice what room there will be for the king's entertainment. Here were also the jurats of the town of Dover, come to give my lord a visit, and after dinner all went away. I could not but observe that the vice-admiral, after dinner, came into the great cabin below, where the jurats and I and the commanders, for want of room, dined, and there told us we must drink a health to the king and he himself called for a bottle of wine, and begun his and the Duke of York's. In the afternoon I lost five shilling at nine pins. After supper, music, and to bed, having also among us at the coach table, wrote a letter to the French ambassador, in French, about the release of a ship we had taken. After I was in bed, Mr Shepley and Will Howe came and sat in my cabin, where I gave them three bottles of Margate ale, and sat laughing very merry, till almost one o'clock in the morning, and so good night.